Here's Roxana Saberi with a story about taste put to the test. The taste test is mighty important too. Over the decades, taste testing hasn't changed much. That's why tech companies are now trying to teach machines to taste more objectively and precisely than people. But mimicking our sense of taste isn't easy. Our tongues have thousands of taste buds. And taste also involves the nose, which uses hundreds of smell receptors that scientists say can distinguish at least a trillion odors. In Silicon Valley, tech startup Aromic says it's cloned the genes behind almost all of those receptors to measure how they respond to flavors and aromas. So you're trying to create a digital representation of taste and smell. Exactly. Right. Josh Silverman is the CEO. We can give that information back to the companies to say, here's how you can change your recipe to better suit the consumers that you're going after. Our goal is not to put any of the current flavorists or perfumists out of business, but now they have tools to be able to do things they were never able to do before. 